Hey JD from Flux Focus here again with another video. Uh, one of the uh, microcontrollers that uh, I use most, um, the range of microcontrollers is the Freescale range, and uh, I thought I might do a quick uh, hello world with uh, the uh, MC9 SO8 QG8 microcontroller. Uh, that is a 16-pin uh, microcontroller with 512 bytes of RAM and 8K flash. It does have options for internal oscillator or external oscillator. Uh, I'm not going to put the external, uh, sorry, rather external oscillator or crystal. I'm not going to put the crystal on. I'm going to use the uh, the internal internal oscillator and uh, that's the let's see if I got that the right way up yep that's the chip so it's pretty small uh, 16 pin dip package and uh, yeah all I'm gonna do is uh, just put a bit of a board together that um, will have the microcontroller flashing an LED on and off the microcontroller is a 3.3 uh, .3 volt uh, device. I don't have a through hole regulator, so I'm going to use a, an LD1117 uh, in uh, what's that? A SOT223 package. Uh, and I think from here, I'll speed up the video and uh, we'll we'll do a bit of code at the end.
so that's as far as the board goes for the moment. Um, the uh, a few power supply components down the side. Um, automatic reset capacitor and resistor for the reset pin, uh, and just a um, filter cap for uh, the power pins. Uh, the LED. This connector, <coughs> this connector over here, is for uh, the in-circuit programmer, uh, and I'm using the PNE Micro um, BDM Multilink. Uh, BDM stands for Background Debug Module. 